Who doesn't love a beautiful flower? Here in Texas, we celebrate our flowers by having nice festivals. So I'm Chef Keisha. Join me today as we celebrate the sunflower, our anniversary, and Father's Day at Sweet Eats Fruit Farms. Meet me in the car. Let's go. Going out to Sweet Eats Fruit Farms here in Georgetown, Texas. And we're going to um, just see what's going on out there. Just, you know, doing something, getting out the house, doing something different. It is our anniversary weekend. So not only is our anniversary weekend, it's our it's Father's Day weekend. So we're gonna go out there and do that. And then on Monday is our anniversary. So we didn't want to sit in the house this weekend. We wanted to go out and just do some, do some things, do some things different. And. Uh, it's a place that we've been before. I have a video of us picking strawberries with our son, with our grandson out there. I think it was last year. And then we also did, went back the second day to look at the animals and the farm and all that stuff like that. So if you haven't seen that video, go back and check that video out. But today we're going there because they are having a, what is it? A sunflower festival. So um, we're going to go there and it's supposed to be really nice. Um, they have like acres, like 4.6 acres of sunflower on one side and then another whole big side of sunflowers. It's supposed to have live music. Um, just a bunch of whole, a whole a bunch of different things. So we're going to go out there today, me and my husband. I will uh, talk to you guys in a minute once we get to the farm. So we are getting ready to enter into Sweet Eats Fruit Eat Sweet Eats Fruit Farm where they're having the the, stra the I say strawberry sunflower festival. Let's go enter in and see what we can get into. Oh look! Look babe! Look! Look at there! Like peach tree. Mm. Oh man, they have a lot of peaches out on these trees. Awesome. Do not pick, pick. Peaches aren't ripe yet. Follow us on Facebook for picking updates. Oh, okay. So I guess we can only pick during a certain time of the year. Yeah, when they're fully ripe. <laughs> Hello. Hi. Pictures. Sure, so our picture uh, spot is going to be right over here in the medicine. Okay. Right over here? Yes, ma'am. We have multiple props uh, scattered throughout, so you have to take some pictures. Okay, okay. Thank, thank you. you. All right, I'll have a fun time. Thank you. Sunflowers, sunflowers everywhere. Stop. You going to take a picture with us? Mm -hmm. I guess that's the prop area. Yes, Um, we just finished walking through the fields of sunflowers mm -hmm. and I'm here with one of the workers. What's your name? Yeah, Johnny. Johnny. So mm -hmm. Johnny's going to tell you a little bit about Sweet Eats Fruit Farms and what they do out here. Yeah, so at our farm we have lots of activities for families <clears throat> and couples. Even people come on date nights here. Um, it's really fun. Um, right now we're doing our sunflower festival and so that's what you were mm -hmm. part of just now. Um, we also have pony rides, petting zoo. We have face painting, you name it, we probably have it here. Um, is the bakery set up yet? The bakery is not set up yet, but the bakery is coming. We're hoping by Fall Fest mm -hmm. this year. Um, we'll, we'll follow us on Facebook, you'll figure, you'll find all that information out. Okay, and they mm -hmm. can find you on Facebook for you. Yeah, it's just Sweet Eats, um, Sweet Eats Fruit Farm. Okay. That's where you're gonna okay. find us on Facebook. So let me ask you a couple questions okay. about sunflowers. Okay. So I saw that some of them had like different colors. Mm -hmm. Now, traditionally, I've always seen them like the bright yellow color. Right. So what makes them like the purple and the black and all that? Yeah, I, the basic answer is it's a variety difference, mm -hmm. okay? And so um, when you're seeing the traditional ones, you're usually probably thinking about the ones that are planted for oil mm -hmm. to make oil, okay? okay? Wow. The oil is made from the seeds of the sunflowers. Mm -hmm. um, and oil seed sunflowers is what the variety is or what we kind of call it around here there's also several just natural ones that pop up and grow everywhere and so 
but there are different varieties, just like there are different colored goats at the farm, <laughs> or different tasting strawberries or different peaches. There are different varieties of sunflowers. Okay. Some of them grow different colors. So, wow. Yeah. So you could, it could be, you, yeah. you never know what you're going to get Yeah, I don't plant. know if you saw this sign. No, show I didn't. It a little bit, but we have a variety sign okay. showing all the kinds of here, which is pretty cool. Okay. So there you go. So tell me about the sunflower seeds, actually. Where, where, yeah. where do they come from in the, in the flower? Yeah, yeah. So basically what happens is you have a flower um, bud, and eventually it pops open, right? In the very middle of the, of the flower, and the way that it per reproduces itself is it has seeds in the very middle. Okay. The seed head. Okay. And then as the plant continues to grow, the flower opens up wider, wider, and then the middle of it will dry out with the sun. Eventually it will look like sunflower seeds, but they're going to be all kind of whitish at first, and then mm -hmm. they're going to dry out more and more and be like a brown color. Um, and then that's the time that you're going to roast them. If you're if you're picking ones to roast, mm -hmm. you'll pick a bigger flower that'll have bigger seeds, and those are really good for roasting. Um, and so that's where this, the flower, the seeds come from. <laughs> <laughs> and that's where the oil comes from as well. That's right. Okay, uh -huh. so the oil comes from that seed that you pull from that's the middle right. of it. Yeah, wow. just like any other nut or seed, it's high in a fat, fat content. Okay. Mm -hmm. That's why. Wow. Okay, well, thank you so yeah. much. Yeah, you're welcome. Yeah. I got all that information. Thanks for coming out today. Yes, we love make it. sure if you're in Georgetown, okay. Texas area, uh -huh. you come out here. And, yes. Oh, oh. And then they have other things too, like I saw the peaches coming up soon. Yeah, so we'll have peaches. You'll have to follow us on Facebook because it's more, it's one of those like, they're not ready today and they're ready tomorrow right. kind of thing. <laughs> but we think they're gonna be ready in about one to two weeks. Wow. Well, um, we'll have some coming. peaches. We're gonna get yeah. some peaches and we're gonna make something with it. Guys. All right, so we're gonna go and we're gonna get on the ride thing now to ride around the farm so I can give you another view of Sweet Eats Fruit Farm. <laughs> this trailer is brand new. Uh, today is the first day in circus, both of these trailers. Uh, they were uh, shipped in from northern Pennsylvania, made by the Amish. Okay. So they're very, very sturdy, very yes. well made, but as you can probably see, no frills. You know, there's no you know, cushions on the seat or whatever, no shocks on the trailer. Right. So we're going to be going a little slower. Uh, so the only rule is stay seated while we're moving so you don't fall. Um, other than that, have fun. Alright, so we're moving. We're gonna travel around the park. They didn't have the live music out there yet, but my husband said that's supposed to be later on in the weeks to come where they'll have the live music and all that out. But we got us a nice bouquet of sunflowers and we're going to plant them. We also got a bunch of pictures and we were able to interview one of the staff. So now we're going to go home. We're going to put these in a nice vase and um, arrange them pretty. And then, um, this is girl hot, right? See how this went? But other than that, 
you know, and they can't control that. But other than that, you know, we had a really nice time. We saw a lot of beautiful sunflowers. We were able to ride the, the tractor um, caging, whatever you call it. And what else did we do? Walk the trails. My husband got a lot of pictures. And, um, yeah. So, we, and they had drinks out there. So we were able to get like some Gatorades to cool off. They had like a big a place where you could sit where they had like a cooling fan and you could sit to cool off just a little, a little bit. Um, so they made, you know, they made provisions for you, you know, um, if you come out there in the heat of the day. So here's a picture of the vase that I made with the sunflowers that we got from the festival. Even though I'm not a professional, I love the way that they turned out. Anyhow, I'm going to relax now. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please like, share, comment, all that good stuff. And I'll see you on the next video if the Lord say the same and the creek don't rise. Bye.